some breaking news in China and it, it's regarding Manuel Pellegrini. So he has been linked heavily. He is the favourite for the West Ham job after they sacked, well, they didn't renew the contract of David Moyes. And today he has been, it's been announced by Hebe Fortune that he is leaving and he will be going from the Chinese Super League and he will be joining, probably joining West Ham. Um, so I haven't made a video about this yet, um, so now seems a good time to do it as I have the Scottish Cup final on in the background. So he started at Villarreal, he had five years at Villarreal. Real Madrid for a year where he finished on a massive 96 points a 75% win ratio but he didn't win the title and he got sacked spent three years at Malaga three years at City and he has been at Hebe Fortune for eight, around 18 months um, in that time he has won the Premier League the League Cup twice uh, the UEFA Cup and uh, some other bits and pieces in um, over in South America. Um, I think he will be a good appointment. Uh, he's someone different. Uh, he's still very, very clever. He's had a very good win ratio, uh, you know, at City, 60%, and Real Madrid at 75%. But when he was at Real Madrid, he brought heavily he brought in Xabi Alonso he brought in Kaka and he brought in Ronaldo he spent a lot of money there and they didn't win the title um, which is basically you have to win the title pretty much at, uh, at Real Madrid or you get sacked as he found out or, or you have to win the Champions League you have to win something he didn't win anything and that's what happens um, so he joined Manchester City in 2013 and they won the league they scored 102 goals 86 points uh, they had a very good season I'm just trying to find out who they brought um, transfers in so they brought Fernandinho Jesus Navas Alvaro Negredo Stefan Djokovic and Martin Dimachelis. So he spent around near like 90 ish million. So that's obviously a lot. So he'll probably want a lot of resources um, from West Ham. He'll want a lot of backing from West Ham. Will they give it him? Remains to be seen. But clearly, he has had the backing. Clearly, he's had some sort of promise to leave Hebei China Fortune. Uh, which have spent a lot of money as well on players. Uh, he plays obviously a decent brand of, brand of football. They scored a, over 100 goals in that season, which is incredible. And that is something that West Ham want. They want nice football. Uh, will he be the answer? It obviously remains to be seen. But at this point, it can't get much worse than it was under Bilic and at times under Moyes, can it? Um, He's had success at City, and if he delivered just the League Cup and decent place finishes, I think that they would be happy at West Ham. Um, and lo it looks like he is on his way to London. So the former Real Madrid manager is going to be managing with, um, with West Ham, and he is another person who has also won the... Um, the Premier League. He hasn't really done much since leaving City, let's be honest. Um, but the problem is, when you were offered so much money to go out to China, and you know, we've seen lots of people do it, we've seen so many people do it, um, then it makes sense to me, you know, at the end of the day, if you worked at a bar, uh, just say you worked at uh, Wellerspoons, and you got paid, I don't know, nine pound an hour for argument's sake and then someone was opening a new bar let's say a marston's or beef eater or something like that and they offered you 16 pound an hour what are you gonna do you're gonna you're obviously going to leave you're nearly doubling your wages or doubling your wages 
and that's what happens here. And Hebe China Fortune, he's been in charge for nearly 50 games. He's won just 20, drawn 12, and lost 17. That's not the best. Who do they have? They have um, Lavezzi, uh, who's one of the highest paid players in the world, Hernandez and Jovino. And they also have just signed recently Javier Mascherano. So, in the season before last season, 2017, finished fourth in the league last year. And they were two points away from the Champions League playoff rounds. And, yeah, so that wasn't too bad. This season, um, I will check, 2018... They are 8th, which is mid-table. There's 16 sides in it. 1-4, drawn 3, and lost 4. Scored 16, and conceded 16. So 15 points after 11. I mean, there's no sort of knowing how it is, how good this league is. Um, but it is something that um, a lot of good players have been in. Um, so let me know your thoughts down below. If you're a West Ham fan, are you keen on having a former Premier League winner in Manuel Pellegrini as your manager. Let me know your thoughts down below. How do you think he will get on? Um, but it is seeming very likely now that Pellegrini will be moving to the London Stadium. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will be back later with FA Cup review. Um, so keep an eye out for that one. I am Mike and I will see you soon.